Hi, I'm Brianna and welcome to my channel. So in today's video, I'm going to be talking about new moons in astrology and how you can manifest with a new moon because I know it's such like a big hot topic over on TikTok and I'd imagine it would be one on YouTube here as well. So new moons, new moons in astrology symbolize new beginnings new moon new beginnings so when we have a new moon this is a great time for us to manifest new beginnings and in the world when you have a new moon you may see the start of a new cycle or people deciding to you may suddenly have an urge to change something about you in your life um, yeah, so the next new moon we have is January 21st, 2022, and 2023, sorry, I'm not used to it, the, first, the next new moon we have is the 21st, let me just check to see if this is the first new moon of the year, it is, and it is in the sign of Capricorn. Now, let me tell you why this is important, okay? So, the sign that the new moon is in can be crucial to helping you figure out what areas of, the, of your life you can manifest and help you with with extra power. So, the new moon is going to be in Capricorn this time. And for example, I have a Capricorn 8th house because I'm a Gemini rising. So... The 8th house rules shared finances. Um, it can rule occult matters, sex, intimacy. And for me, let's say I wanted to manifest for this new moon. This could be a great time for me to manifest a partnership. A partnership of intimacy or a partner, a deeper connection with um, a business partner I already have to increase that intimacy. This could be a great time to start a path of change in that sense. Um, another example, let's say you're a Capricorn rising. So you have Capricorn, this new moon in your first house. This could be a great time to initiate a plan and get ready to manifest a change in appearance. Maybe you want to start a new weight loss plan. Let's say maybe you wanted to do that for the new year, and then you're like, hmm, I haven't really been doing that. Now's your chance with this Capricorn new moon. And if you don't know your rising sign, you don't know what your houses are, that's okay. And this also goes for just general. So Capricorn in general is a hard working sign. Capricorn typically rules in general sense the 10th house and it's ruled by Saturn. So this is like big boss business sense. This is like this is like entrepreneurial old money it girl energy. So with the new moon in Capricorn, you can manifest money. That's really what the goal here is, manifesting money, manifesting um, stability or, um, having some sort of form of authority in your life. This is the general sense for the new moon in Capricorn. So with new moons, the usual thing is you're going to be manifesting something new or a change in a routine or a cycle you've had. You're manifesting something new or a change like a complete 180 to something you're already doing. So usually on the new moon, you can just decide that you're going to manifest, that you can do manifestation methods, whatever you want to do. But I also suggest making a game plan on the new moon of the how you're going to get your manifestation. And then the days following the new moon are the best times to put action into that goal. And then on the full moon, you should gain some sort of manifestation. It's a culmination. And that's how the cycle really works. And then after the new moon, you reflect and think, hmm, what can I do next? How can I make this better? What changes can I make? 
and just really start reflecting on that. Enjoy the manifestation manifestations you already have. And then when the new moon comes around, make another game plan. Make a plan for a new manifestation. Manifest something new. And that's how it really works. This is how you manifest with a new moon. Um, I probably should have given you guys my qualifications for astrology at the beginning. But I've been practicing astrology for... Um, a little over three years now, so I'd like to say I know what I'm talking about. Um, anyways, yeah, I think I'm gonna be doing a full moon um, manifestation video sooner or later. So, yeah, I hope you enjoyed this video. Please like, subscribe, and I'll see you guys next time. Bye bye.